morning friends it's miss schultz it is a beautiful and sunny day today look i got to go out to the outside office it is very warm tadpole does not want to sit on my lap because he would like to go play he's got a toy out here i've got my breakfast out here and we're hanging out outside so it is monday it is april 20th 2020 and we will be working like this for the rest of the school year the governor last week when we were on spring break said that schools were closed for the rest of the school year. And I don't know what that means for our work together, but I know for sure that I will be making a video every day for you. I'm sure the powers that be down at Central Office are working hard to come up with a plan for us so we know what to do. I hope today that you get to go outside and enjoy the sun. And it is kind of chilly, but it's not super cold that I was, I was like, hey, let's go eat outside. So I got my breakfast over there and my coffee and tadpole, and we're going to hang out outside for a little bit. So today's word of the day is drowsy, and drowsy means someone who is sleepy or slightly tired. So if you think about when you know that it's time to go to bed, that you might feel a little bit drowsy because you're a little bit sleepy. Sometimes when you wake up in the morning and you aren't really awake yet, you still feel drowsy. So people who are drowsy might yawn or close their eyes. They're not going to be jumping around and prancing around. Ooh, that was our word of the day. So today I brought with me this book, Giggle, Giggle, Quack, and we know all about Farmer Brown and the cows and the chicken and the ducks and how they all get in trouble on the farm. So it's Giggle, Giggle, Quack. Turn the computer down a little bit. Farmer Brown was going on vacation. He left his brother Bob in charge of the animals. Bob gave Duck a good long stare and went inside. He read his first note. Tuesday night is pizza night, not the frozen kind. The hens prefer anchovies. Giggle, giggle, look. Twenty-nine minutes later, there was hot pizza in the barn. Bob checked on the animals before he went to bed. Everything was just fine. Wednesday is bath day for the pigs. Wash them with my favorite bubble bath and dry them off with my good towels. Remember, they have sensitive skin. Giggle, giggle, wink. Bob had all the pigs washed in no time. Farmer Brown called on Wednesday night to check in. Did you feed the animals like I wrote in the note, he asked. Done, Bob replied, counting seven empty pizza boxes. Did you see my note about the pigs? All taken care of, said Bob proudly. Are you keeping a very close eye on the duck, he asked. Bob gave Duck a good long stare. Duck was too busy sharpening his pencil to notice. Just keep him in the house, ordered Farmer Brown. He has a bad influence on the cows. Giggle, giggle, moo, giggle, wink, giggle, quack. Thursday night is movie night. It's the cow's turn to pick. Giggle, giggle, moo. Bob was in the kitchen popping corn just as the animals settled in to watch the sound of music. The phone rang. The only thing Farmer Brown heard on the other end of the phone was giggle, giggle, quack, giggle, moo, giggle, oink. Uh oh. Duck! screamed Farmer Brown. It's for you, Bob! Here comes Farmer Brown rushing home. That is the end of our story for today. I will see you again tomorrow. It's supposed to be cold, the coldest day of the week. So I probably will not be in the outside office. I'm going to eat my breakfast and throw the ball for Tadpole a little bit. And I will see you all tomorrow. Air hugs for everybody.